Hey, Kirsten. Oh, Miranda, hi. I didn't hear you knock. Sorry. I, I'm just so excited. I can't think straight. Well, what's going on? Girl stuff. Well, I was a girl once. <laughs> okay, there's this really cute guy who's going to ask me out. Oh, okay, you could tell Naomi about it. Told you you wouldn't be interested. Right, you did. All right, go see Naomi. You know her, where her room is. Okay. I have a bad feeling about this. It's open. Hey. Oh, hey, Miranda. So, you excited about the dance? Yeah, but it's not until next Friday. I know, but it's going to be so cool. Why are you so excited? You don't even have a date. You're like me, but neither of us have dates. That's where you're wrong. What do you mean that's where I'm wrong? Jeff asked me to the dance. Jeff? My ex-boyfriend, Jeff? Yeah. Technically, he was my boyfriend first, and then he was interested in you. Then he dumped you, and now he's interested in me again. So what did you tell him? You told him no, I hope. Are you kidding? I'm going with him. He's so cute. But why would you go with him when he's playing with both of our emotions? If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were jealous. I'm not jealous. I'm just confused. Are you my friend or aren't you? What are you talking about? I mean that, you know, as my friend, you should have said no. Because you and I both had our hearts broken over this guy. And suddenly your opinion about him changes. And not only are you going to the dance with him, you're going to the dance with him even though it hurts me. You'll get over it. I thought you would have been more happy for me. I thought you would be more considerate of me. Well, I guess we're both disappointed, huh? Yeah, I guess so. Well, I'm not going to sit here and wallow in your self-pity. I'm going to go home and go through my closet and find the perfect dress. Yeah, you do that because I'm not going to the dance. Hang out with Jeff. Fine, don't go to the dance. You're lost. I got to get home. Is it? It's Kit. Can I come in? I kind of want to be left alone, okay? Kit, what part of I want to be left alone didn't you get? I got what you're saying, but I'm not going to leave you alone because obviously you're upset. Well, if you think, if you know I'm upset, why are you bothering me? Because I'm your little sister. What does that have to do with anything? Because you're my big sister, I love you, and I want to try to make you feel better. I can't stand to see you like this. I heard, I've been he he listening to you cry for the past ten minutes. What happened? It wasn't Miranda just to you? You could tell me. Kit, just go, okay? You wouldn't understand. Why not? I've had fights with my friends before. It's not that we fought that you wouldn't understand. It's why we fought. Well, what happened? Just go, kid. You're too young to understand. Will you stop saying that? Can you at least tell me what your fight was about? It was about a boy, okay? Ugh. I don't want to talk about boys. If you excuse me, I gotta go get my cootie shot. sweetie. Hi, Mom. Honey, um, I want to talk to you for a minute. Can you put your computer down for a minute? Sure.
What's up? Honey, I overheard you and your sister arguing. Do you know what's wrong with her? I heard her crying. Yeah, that's why I came to see her, to see if she was okay, but she won't tell me what's wrong. She said I wouldn't understand. She said it was about a boy, but she said I wouldn't understand. Oh, I see. Why does it look like a light bulb went off on your head? Because I think I know what's going on. Or will somebody buy me a vow? Kid, I'll see you at dinner, okay? I gotta go talk to your sister. What is, what is this about? What's what about? The fight. Honey, you all understand when you're older. I'm beginning to hate the fact that I'm the youngest. Don't worry, kid. You, you'll start to grow up. I'm eight years old. I thought I already was grown up. You are, honey, but there are just some conversations that you have to wait till you get old. Okay. I really hate being the younger one. I really do. Who is it? Naomi, honey, it's your mom. Did I come in? I don't care. Hi, honey. Hi. Kit is worried about you. She's worried about me? Why? She's only eight. Why would she worry about me? Because she loves you. And I'm worried about you too. What are you so upset about? I'm upset because I, this guy Jeff that me and Miranda both like, asked Miranda to the dance, even though she knew how I felt about him. And Miranda doesn't seem to care. She said I was jealous. What well, are you? I don't know. Maybe a little. We shouldn't let jealousy get, get in the way of your friendship. You should be happy for Miranda. Besides, when Miranda was dating him the first time, you took him away from her. And now he's back with Miranda. Yeah, but if he's, if he's going to go back and forth between me and Miranda, he's not worth getting upset over. Oh, did I just make a point? Okay, all right, I wasn't fair to Miranda. After all that's happened, I wasn't fair to her. I don't think you were either, honey, but I can understand how you feel. Give Miranda a call, honey. Okay. All right. Dinner will be ready soon. Okay. I love you. I love you too. <sighs> Hello? Hey, Miranda, it's me. Naomi? Yeah, who else would it be? I don't know. I thought it was you, but I thought you were mad at me. Look, as much as I hate to admit it, I'm not mad at you. I, I'm jealous. You're jealous of me? Yes, you don't have to rub it in and pretend that you are surprised by that. Well, I guess I kind of helped you make you feel jealous a little bit because I kept bragging about how much fun the dance would be. If you want, I could skip the dance and we could have a sleepover or something. I would like that, but I'd feel bad that you'd be missing the dance. But you're not going. I know, I don't want to go. Is it because I'm going with Jeff? You guys will be dancing all night and I'll just be up against the wall with the other wallflowers. And that's not my idea of a fun Friday night. Well, maybe after I come home from the dance, we could have to sleep over. Then I can do both. And you won't feel bad. Okay. I'll have to ask my mom, but I'm sure I'll be okay. All right. Let me know, okay? I will. Um, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Hey, Mom.